Hello, in this uh, AWS uh, development, developing series, I wish to demonstrate about uh, module 10, uh, knowledge check, okay. So this uh, topic is on developing with uh, messaging services. So I would be uh, going through this knowledge check, you will be having about around 10 questions where you need to answer uh, at least 70% of these things should be correct and uh, most important thing is uh, these questions are important for your exam preparation so if you prepare well then it will become easy for your developer associate exam so let me start uh, this uh, questions of uh, module 10 okay so the first question should be on your screen yes the first question is which option describes how a message queue process messages so the answer is the queue polls producers for new messages no consumers poll the queue for messages yes let me check yes this is correct answer the second one which option describes how publish slash subscribe messaging works so the answer is a new topic message if pushed out to all topic subscribers yep this is correct the third one a developer wants to add an amazon sqs queue to decouple incoming order request from a backend database which Amazon SQS operations might be part of this update. So use the receive message operation with maximum number of messages set to 5 to retrieve up to 5 messages of the queue at one time. Yeah, this is correct. Fourth one, a tester reports that Amazon SQS messages are being processed more than once. The developer finds that processing servers are not completing as quickly as ex expected and messages are made available to other consumers before the prior consumer deletes them. Which option might reduce the occurrence of this issue? So increase the visibility timeout. Yes, this is the correct answer. Okay. The fifth one. For an order processing application that uses an Amazon SQS queue. A developer finds that an older version of the client generates order records that fail the backend process. The failures cause a bottleneck on the queue. How might the developer reduce the impact of failed records? So what we can do is add a dead letter queue and set a low max receive count. Yeah, this is good. Six. Which statement about Amazon SQS polling options is true? So, yeah, when short polling is configured, Amazon SQS samples a subset of its servers. Okay, this is good. Seventh one, which statement about Amazon SQS is true? An SNS topic is a logical access point which acts as a communication channel. Yes, that is correct. Eight one. An Amazon SNS topic receives messages about orders. An AWS Lambda function that processes cancelled orders is subscribed to the topic. How might the developer reduce cost by only invoking the Lambda function for cancelled orders? So we can uh, yeah we can set up a filter policy so that amazon lambda function subscription only received cancel order messages yes that's correct the ninth one a developer needs to build a custom application to put customer application log records onto kinesis streams data stream what should they use to build uh, the application we used to we need to have a producer library KPL Kinesis Producer Library. Yep. The tenth one. Which statement about Kinesis data, I mean uh, data streams, is true? 
So, the data records in the data stream are distributed into shards. This is the one. Okay, this is correct. And we have completed the last one. So, the score is 100%. Thank you. Let us again visit module 11. Bye.